to you that the mystery of the missing rock shall be unraveled. For all I know, somebody stole it. Mm -hmm. One of my enemies. Mm -hmm. Not that any it was a massive turnout at the just held command performance of the stage play The King Must Dance Naked. Sharing their excitement of the success so far, executive producer Jake Siva and producer Sergio Jacobs had this to say. We started work seriously in November and we have been working every day since then. And I appreciate all the actors, I appreciate all the direct, you know, the work of the director. Everybody has put in blood, sweat, and tears, and they've done it. And it's wonderful that the audience are appreciated. We're, we're glad that as a finale, we're able to have um, um, dignitaries and um, supporters, stakeholders to come and watch the show, which is essential for us. It's showing that our hard work is paying off, and obviously, word of mouth has spread. You know, we sent out invitations, but at the same time, we also did lots of mass publicity about the show, interviews, reviews, and so that has also brought uh, a good number of people to the show today. Former Governor of Lagos State, Babatunde Fashola, actress Ego Boyo, former First Lady of Ekiti State, Irilubi Sifayemi, and others commended the cast and crew while sharing their experience. I mean, theatre is for us in the industry life. This is for a number of us how we started. It's a wonderful way of you know, telling stories. It's something that must be encouraged. We need to get more people to come out and watch. And I mean, I think it's one of those things where we just have to keep doing the work and then the people will come. It was truly a remarkable show. Uh, great um, talent display. And uh, what a time really for the resurgence of the theater arts and thespian work. And uh, also the location itself, the Global Hall. Um, I think all the elements are, are converging for the renaissance of talent at a time that perhaps in human history, talent is being so mostly rewarded. It's, it's something I've been saying over and over, is that we need to invest more in the creative arts in this country. There are so many stories waiting to be told. There are so many old stories waiting to be retold and so many talents to be discovered and rediscovered. So congratulations to all those who put this together and to my amazing sister Joke Silva of the Photo Productions. Well done, darling sis. More is yet to come. Just like the cinemas, they also reveal what the future holds for stage play. Indeed, theatre is of age and it's good work. Good work calls for more work. Um, you see large turnout because word of mouth, people are going out to tell people of the experience they've had here. And that's why you see that the hall is full. We will definitely be back. It's just consistency. People are already beginning because uh, for this December, January period, we have more than 10 different stage plays that happened. And it turned out massive. So it's just consistency and support. Consistency. The event was held at the Global Memorial Hall, Marina Lagos.